Alrighty. Well, I guess I'll go this way. So, for starters, so RFID tag there, nothing special. This is uh, my video for the submission to the Radio Shack uh, Arduino thingamajiggy. Just got an email about it, so I figured I'd uh, real quick upload my front door thingy here. So you can see this is the inside of my house. The doorknob, it's just uh, just there for show. Doesn't actually do anything. <clears throat> This is the actual door lock. Oh. Then, uh, piece of metal thingy there. It's the electromagnetic door lock. You can kind of see a bit of a spaghetti monster in there. And uh, behind here is the uh, RFID tag reader. And uh, oh, even I kind of cheated wires. Anyway, moving right along, gotta go downstairs to uh, get to the guts of the thing. Alright, there's a network cable going up, and that uh, Cat5 cable does all, has all the uh, wires and whatnot that go up into the, the wall there. And then here is, here's the guts. There's a 12 to 5 volt rectifier. Didn't realize I didn't need that, but I have one anyway. There's the Arduino. There's a little circuit board. There's a relay on it, transistor and whatnot that... Uh, controls the output that changes the 5 volt output from the Arduino and uses that to turn the uh, magnetic lock on and off. Here's the 12 volt power supply that includes a battery backup so that when my house, if I were to lose power, I still have my uh, front door locked. So that's my, uh, my submission. I figure I already had it in place. I'd go ahead and submit it because it's pretty cool. Always a bonus having a house with an RFID door entry. So, <clears throat> I guess that's it. I uh, hope you like that. I do. It makes my life a lot easier. Uh, thanks for watching.